live? Are we live? Maybe not. Aloha. Let's see if anybody's here. Oh, it's just me. Just me. Uh, do, 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 do. Let us know if anyone's here. Can he see anyone? Hmm. Well, we'll wait a minute. See if Joe jumps on. Oh, hello. Stefan, dude. Gus. Something in the mail for you, sunshine. Um, let us know if you can hear us all right, because... I feel like I'm talking to myself. <laughs> Hello, Jay. How's it going, sunshine? You good? Oh. Sunshine down here. I don't know about you guys. Wherever you are. Gus on the other side of the UK. Jay in Northern. Uh, we'll give it a minute or so. See uh, who else jumps on. Uh, cheers, Gus. Do you want to take Dell and a few others for me? It'll be epic. Oh. Give us a thumbs up if you're having a good day. Mr. Nixon, isn't it? He's probably on a ban, isn't he? All good, sunshine. Still got your uh, Christmas card here. Hey, Jean. Cold? Bloody cold on the pen. Yeah, Stu, I think, yeah, you, you're probably going to feel it a bit there. I was going to say, sunny. Sunny in Bristol. I mean, it's a bit, bit of a nip in the air, but, you know. Luckily, got something to warm me up in a minute. Other than the coffee. Tina, Liam, guys, good. Liam, is it ever not freezing in Edinburgh? Ah, oh, Luciano. Oh, sunshine. <laughs> oh, fun times. So, as you might have gathered from the fact that I've uh, tagged Jay in it, we we're uh, going to do one of his sources today. Um, super excited as I've been holding on to this for a while. Um, well, is it my internet, Stu, or is it yours? <laughs> okay, cool. Sorry, Stu, you can watch it back on catch up. Um, yeah, sorry, sorry, as I was just saying, I've been holding on to a couple of sources from Mr. J here, um, of Wildside Hot Sources. Now, I don't believe these are yet available for purchase, so that makes me pretty, pretty special. Um, so I thought I'd give one a go today. Uh, we are going to do Phoenix. Now, anyone who is on socials would have probably seen the hype around this guy. Hello, Brandon. So, made from the heart, enlighten your soul and bring out the phoenix inside you. In order to rise from its own ashes, a phoenix must first burn. This is where it all started. Makes great for an everyday sauce. Dipping, home cooking, barbecues, you name it. Everything deserves a big dollop. So, this is made in Shropshire. So, not too far from most of us. Um, this one, we have got some Scotch bonnets, some cayenne. Uh, we've got some spices. We've got white wine vinegar, mango, pineapple, passion fruit. 
yellow peppers, garlic, onions, pineapple juice, salt, pepper, and sugar. Oh, a bit of xanthan gum. I think I said that right. Um, obviously, as per normal, please go give these guys uh, a follow on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter. Just, yeah, give them, give them some love. Um, vegan friendly, gluten free. All the things that you'd expect. Now this one, so I got a bit of glare from the light. We got three, three X's, three crosses. Um, so I expect this to be kind of a low to medium heat. Um, so let's crack it open. I've got my spoon. Is it me that freezes? Uh, or is it you guys? It's a nice little pop. <sighs> Lovely smell first off the bat. Fruity. A little bit of a vinegar. Spices. Um, there are spices. Not entirely sure what they are, um, so I maybe give Jay a little little shout if you uh, if you want to know a little bit more. Um, so finish poor, um, but with, with a nice texture to it, nice body on it. This is a bit where I always end up nearly pouring it all over my laptop. So I don't know if you guys can see the colour on that one. But everything that you'd expect from a fruity sauce. Yeah, out of the bowl. Smells lovely. A um, little bit, little bit of heat to it from the smells. But mm, yeah. So first off, the fruit that kicks it kicks in, and then. Straight at the back of the throat, a nice little burn. Um, I'd say for probably all of you lying here, it's probably yeah, uh, a low to mid burn. Tasty, like really, really tasty. Um, the blend on that is really, really good. Um, I've got some um, non-specified tangy cheese, um, chips, dips. So again, really nice pour on it. Ah, you might be able to... Ah. Oh, you're waiting for the moment it falls. But yeah, you can see colour on that. you got some herbs in there. You can see the spice in. Ah. Jay, I did the shake beforehand, mate. Didn't want to bore everyone with all the uh, finer details, but yeah, if it makes you feel better. What are you talking about, me? Do a little shake for you. Let's see if that makes a difference. Um, yeah, the pineapple it comes through. I mean, it's a oh shit, it's a fruity sauce. And uh, excuse my language there. There you go, a slightly f thicker consistency, so, um, yeah. Sorry, Jay. Oh. There you go. Nice consistency on that. Hmm, yeah, I would say the mango and passion fruit probably comes through a little bit more than the pineapple, um, but maybe that's just my palate, um, but that is delicious, got a nice, nice heat to it, um, but not, not anything that's going to put a lot of these people off, um, yeah, I'll give you another 
another spoonful Jay as he says nice big dollop um, yeah I don't know I've I would say probably uh, probably good five five heat maybe out of ten um, but again I mean it's so hard to say because obviously everyone's tolerance is so so different but there you go see if you can make out the color a little bit more you see all the little flecks in there um from all the spices and the pepper mm. yeah reckon that make a really good marinade for some wings as well because nice and fruity nice nice kick to it um Halloumi cheese, that is a great shell, Chris. Yeah, yeah, all over that. Um, something I've used with my pineapple curry in the past. Um, it definitely works. Um, give it a good basting, get it on the grill. Absolutely. Um, Jay would have to make any suggestions for some vegan cheeses. Unfortunately, I'm not not that familiar. But, um, but yeah, I mean, that um, is an absolute banger. Gonna have to watch out for this one when it drops. Um, get in there, pre-order, do whatever you need to do. Um, but well, so I remember that name because he is gonna go massive. Um, like I say, give him a follow, order as soon as it's live. Uh, there is a whole range. Um, one I'm particularly looking forward to. I've got next is Medusa, um, and uh, one that. Um, it's caught my eye. I think it's called Pig Face. A uh, bit of a ba bacon, bacon ensemble. So, um, yeah, Jay, you nailed it, mate. Absolutely. Sorry it's taken me so long to do this. Um, I will get you your Christmas present eventually. Um, we we'll have some beers, but there you go. Those labels, absolutely on point. Go check them out. Anyway, thank you for everyone who's jumped on. Um, just a quick self-plug as it's Monday. Um, don't forget I've got 20% off all of my products on the website, haskells.co.uk. Um, I've got shipping pretty much every day at the moment because the kids are back to nursery. Um, so yeah, um, check it out. Give us a ping if you uh, have any questions on any of the sources. Um, hopefully be looking out for a couple of reviews from some nukes that have um, purchased in the last couple of days um, but thanks again guys for jumping on uh, I'm going to go enjoy the rest of my day before kids get home alright, sound, cheers guys, take care, bye